Welcome, everybody. My name is Minachi. I use she, her pronouns, and I'm going to be leading you through a meditation that's going to be guiding you to find, discover, play with, and feel the good things in your body. It is very, very common to focus on things that are hard, that are painful, that are icky. So if you are like, but it's so much easier to feel the stuff that's not going well. You're in good company. <laughs> this is how we stay safe by keeping our senses, our eyes, our ears vigilant, right, for what might be going wrong, both without and within. And with that said, sometimes that overvigilance, that hyperfixation on what's not going well, what's not feeling great, can really strip us of the beauty around us. We are so busy looking for a fight or squaring up or looking for how to, to hide and stay small, thinking about the tension in our neck, our back, the things we have to do and to fix, that we really lose how much lusciousness is present, how much connection is possible, and also how deeply wanted we are in the world. Aspects of this meditation are going to call upon you to use your intuition. So I will invite you to please don't freak out <laughs> if you're like, I don't know where to go. I can't feel anything. I'm not sure what to do next. Um, I'm going to invite you to just chill and know that you can stay exactly where you are. You can keep your focus and your breathing exactly where it is. In terms of physical setup to sort of prepare yourself and how you want to be for this meditation, there's a few different ways you can do it. One, you're certainly welcome to be seated in a comfortable and supported position. You are also welcome to be lying down. Or you can be doing your dishes, folding laundry, taking care of the kiddos. Our body is with us in all of the wonderful moments of life, the mundane as well as the more intentional, and you get to choose how you want to play. So with that, I'm going to take us into this practice. I'm going to invite you to begin by just placing one hand on some part of your body, some part that you feel called to touch. And if you don't know where that is, then I'm going to invite you to place one hand on your belly. And just begin here with the noticing. Were you even aware of this body part before we brought some attention to it? And also, how has your awareness Change the sensations, the textures, the information that this part of your body is giving to you. I'm going to now invite you to begin to envision a small golden ball of light beginning to dance and move within this part of your body. It is both soft and fluid, while also being clear and steady. And we'll just hold here for a little as you continue with your breathing. Envisioning this marble of light, moving with a little bit of play and exploration in this particular part of your body. And then I'm going to invite you to ask this little ball of light, where would it like to move next? 
where would it like to journey and where would it like to go in exploration? And I'll invite you to intuitively connect with where it wants to travel to and to gently now move your hand to that part of your body. And as you breathe, envision this little ball bouncing, wiggling, drawing a golden strand of light as it moves from the place where it once was to the place that it is now excited to go. And once this little ball reaches its next destination, I'm again going to ask you, how does it feel to connect with this part of your body? What sensations, information, and awareness are coming to you as you are in this moment of presence and practice? Also, how does the ball feel? Is it curious to explore? What does it want to get into? What are the nooks and crannies of crevices that it wants to bring its light into? And again, staying here with some gentle breath as your golden ball of light does its exploration. And now imagining that this little ball of light is ready to travel to its next destination. We'll again invite you to ask this ball, where would you like to go? And as you receive the answer, you can both shift your hand to that part of your body. And also watch as a golden string, a golden thread, moves towards this next location. And through every part of your body where the ball has been, let it feel like a, like a beautiful string of lights, just domino affecting with each other, circuiting and playing and creating chemistry. And again, when this ball reaches this next part of your body, taking some breaths to pause, notice what your initial awareness was. As well as the awareness that is beginning to emerge. And now I will invite you to envision that another sparkly marble has just come forward. You get to pick the color. And it's like they're buddies. They're like best buddies who've never seen each other before, but immediately know how to play. And they're bouncing around, shining their light in this area of your body. Hiding and seeking and creating light in all of the different ways that they sparkle and bounce and move against each other.
And with this next breath, I will invite you to ask them both where do they want to go. They might want to go to the same place. They might want to diverge paths and go in different locations. Feel free to just trust your intuition and to begin to let them roam throughout to the next part of your body. Again, trailing behind a beautiful string of light, a gentle web of connection and play throughout your body. And wherever the balls are now, I'm going to invite you to envision again just more and more gentle friends joining them. Some of them may be playful and mischievous. Others might be a little softer and quieter. But your body is now beginning to buzz, both with the soft vibration of this light as well as the threads that are beginning to weave as you autonomously let them move, let them roam, let them explore the entire wonder of your being. And just notice where they are traveling. Are they traveling upward or downward? Are they moving at the same speed? What is the quality of goofiness with which one of these balls may move? And what does the array of colors feel like as you tap into all of these connection points? With your next breath, I'm going to invite you to call all of these balls of light together into your throat. You can gently place your hand where they have gathered and where they're meeting. And we'll give you the affirmation to say to them, we get to speak our truth and we get to bring good things into the world. And notice how your vocal cords respond, how the magic of this light responds into the vibration of this sentiment and this statement. We get to speak our truth, and we get to bring good things into the world. With your next breath, I'm going to invite you to take a really, really big inhalation. Hold it when you get to the top. And in a moment, I'm going to have you exhale, and you're going to make a big lion's breath or any other kind of exclamation that you want, and you're going to let all of that light, all of that magic, all of that energy come out of your mouth. So any type of exclamation, big exhalation, wiggle your body. And then bring yourself back to a moment of stillness.
reflecting on what's shifted, also what stayed the same. What have you remembered and what have you rediscovered? We'll invite you to take a few more breaths here, offering some gratitude to your body, to your breath, to these lovely wiggly balls of light, and to anyone or anything else that you want to offer gratitude to as we've been in this practice. And then when you're ready, We'll invite you to very softly open your eyes and bring yourself back into your current physical environment. Thank you for letting me be in this moment of play with you. Please hydrate well and may you bring laughter and joy into the rest of your day.